At age 45, Tom Brady continues to defy the odds in the NFL. So far, he has earned over $302 million on the field, and he's guaranteed $15 million for 2022. His endorsement deals with Aston Martin, Under Armour, and other companies have brought him another $52 million. Married to former supermodel Giselle Bunchen, Tom is a proud owner of a $230,000 Ferrari M458T. Want to see the lavish and expensive toys other athletes enjoy? We'll take you around the world and show you some of the highest paid tennis players, soccer, and basketball stars as we reveal the lifestyles of some of the world's greatest athletes. Next, let's dial up the funometer and step into the shoes of Mexican boxer Saul Canelo Alvarez. This 32-year-old makes most of his money with his fists. In 2021 alone, he earned $85 million from two fights and $5 million in endorsements. Alvarez spends his money on sweet rides. His cars are worth over $8 million, including Ferraris, Lamborghinis, and one of the world's fastest road cars, the Bugatti Chiron. It sells for $3.3 million. Alvarez also boasts a 2.4 million Rolls-Royce Ghost, which the boxer admits he rarely drives. He also has a $45 million yacht and a $35 million jet. Next up is the king of endorsements, Roger Federer. His career on-court earnings are around 130 million, but Federer has the highest off-court profits of all athletes due to his deals with high-profile companies like Mercedes-Benz, Rolex, and Uniqlo. Federer walked away from a $10 million per year deal with Nike for a $300 million 10-year deal with Uniqlo. He also signed a 3% equity deal with the On brand. His stake in On is estimated to be worth $300 million. The Funometer hits 5 out of 10 as we jump on the basketball court with the Brooklyn Nets, Kevin Durant. He earns almost $43 million per year, and that will increase. Off-court, he earns $47 million. By 2024, he'll have earned $300 million just from Nike. Durant also has the most expensive car collection in the NBA, valued at around $4 million. Steph Curry earns $45.8 million on the court. The 34-year-old Golden State Warrior earns another $47 million from endorsements. His obsession is not luxury cars, but watches. He owns a $57,000 Cartier Santo Skeleton, a $35,000 Rolex Day Date 40, and a Rolex Deep Sea Dive watch worth $10,000. Neymar is a 30-year-old Brazilian soccer player who plays for Paris Saint-Germain, earning $70 million, with another $25 million from endorsements from firms including Red Bull and Puma. He enjoys pricey toys like an Airbus H145 helicopter worth $14.5 million. Cristiano Ronaldo is a 37-year-old football player from Portugal who earns $60 million a year playing for Manchester United. With a social media following of almost 700 million followers, it's no wonder he makes $55 million in endorsements from the likes of Nike, Herbalife, and others. Ronaldo, another car collector, has an astonishing $24 million of them, including one of the 10 Bugatti Cento Dieces. This car is worth $12 million. Next, we have 127 million reasons to turn the Funometer up to 9 out of 10. Along with his new contract for $46.7 million per year with the LA Lakers, LeBron James' endorsements score $80 million from big names like GMC and Nike. LeBron likes to invest his money. He owns pizza franchises and an entertainment and media company called Spring Hill Entertainment. He partnered with Arnold Schwarzenegger, Cindy Crawford, and Lindsey Vaughn to start a health and wellness company. How could we make this video without mentioning the first ever athlete turned billionaire Michael Jordan? Did you know he almost walked away from his deal with Nike? But after some convincing from his mom, he changed his mind. In its first four years, Nike hoped to earn $3 million from its Air Jordan sneakers. They earned $126 million in the first year. Lionel Messi, the 35-year-old Argentinian soccer star, is the world's highest paid athlete. He earns $55 million in endorsements and a ridiculous $75 million playing for Paris Saint-Germain. That breaks down to, oh, 738,000 a week, 105,000 a day, or $8,790 per hour. Think I should ask for a raise? <laughs>